Anyone here? Anyone? New at 11, newly released body camera footage following that deadly crash on I-70 nearly two weeks ago. The crash involving a charter bus full of high schoolers, a semi, and three other vehicles left six people dead. We thank you for joining us at 11. I'm Colleen Marshall. Carrie is off tonight. The video we are seeing tonight was released by the State Highway Patrol. It shows the chaotic moments in the aftermath of that crash. The Ohio Department of Public Safety also released a new crash report. We warn you what you are about to see might be difficult. NBC Force Caleb Michael takes us through the video and the report. Do we got everybody out? No, they Go! Tonight, new video shows the moment Ohio State Highway Patrol troopers arrived on scene of the fatal I-70 bus crash nearly two weeks ago. Those on scene had to deal with a large plume of black smoke, multiple wrecked vehicles, and an unknown amount of victims. The charter bus involved was taking a group of band students to a conference here in Columbus. I don't see anyone. Somebody get a count on the kid. In a newly obtained traffic report from the Ohio Department of Public Safety, it describes the events of the crash. The narrative says all five vehicles labeled as units were traveling west on I-70. All four of the units, except for Unit 1, the semi-truck, were braking for slowing traffic. That same semi-truck crashed into and through an SUV into the back of the charter bus labeled Unit 3. That bus went into the back of another SUV that was then pushed into a semi-tractor labeled Unit 5. That SUV spun into the left lane, resulting in the large pileup. The report labels Unit 1, the semi-truck, as the vehicle that fought. The driver was given an alcohol test and blew a 0, 0.0. Come on, let's get out! We now know in total 18 people were taken to area hospitals. Six died that day, three of them teenagers. The crash is still under investigation by the National Transportation Safety Board, and we expect their initial report here in a few weeks. Local for you, I'm Caleb Michael, NBC4.